Hi, good morning. Right, today I will showcase uh, how to create a popular chart. Now, uh, the end result is something like this, right? Where I get it from the uh, from the statistic.gov.my, right? So this is a Malaysia's favorite Excel tips, right? We use Malaysia. So uh, here is the number of population by sex and age group, right? Now usually on the left is male and on the right is female. So uh, when you come for my dynamic charts um, or advanced chart things, right? We'll talk about this chart more. As for now, I'm going to show you this. So here's the data, right? And the data here is actually pulled out from a database. So we got some data here, right? Um, Microsoft Access. We'll just type Malaysia. Yeah, so there are some Malaysia data here. Give Malaysia data, and um, we gotta just put it into a peer table, and from there we we'll create. Um, we we'll actually create two table tables and then put it here, and we we'll do a comparisons from 1996 to 2020. Right? So and both for male and female. So this is done without a pure table. Whereas this are pure table. We'll explain in detail what is this. So now I'm gonna showcase more important is the pure table. Uh, it's the population chart. So if we take this and create a popular chart, this is how it works like. But um, I'm able to after the research right able to show that the power that the popular chart can be in this format now which one do you like do you like the chart one or the chart below chart two right obviously this is easier to see right it's 1996 so um those they are those they are higher higher uh, young dependency, right? Young dependency. So what's that young dependency, right? I also explain that in here. So a population of population pyramids is what it says. Yesterday, the age of sex and so on, right? I'll copy this into my uh, Facebook page. You can take a look at that as well. And so the idea is to let you know, right? Open your mind. That's um, Excel chart can do much more again and an episode from Candler creative wise never happened.